Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we will be talking about a pattern which is known as engulfing pattern. Now this engulfing pattern can be a bullish engulfing or a bearish engulfing pattern. But uh, if we study one, you can apply it on the other and vice versa. So let's directly dive into it. So what exactly is a engulfing pattern? Engulfing pattern is nothing but suppose that you have a, a red candle which is being formed something like this. And of course, this candle will have a wick associated with this. And now what happens on the next day is that there is a bullish candle which gets formed. Something like, so what you can expect is what engulfing pattern says is, so this is a bullish engulfing pattern. Similarly, you will have bearish engulfing pattern. But what you can expect over here is, you can expect a bull trend uh, to uh, you know happen after this engulfing pattern gets formed now let's understand the market psychology behind this so what exactly the market psychology behind this is that there was a bearish candle so the sellers were in power but the you know this was the open price of course and this is your close price but the next day the uh you know the prices actually opened lower but the bulls started pushing the market in the upward direction and they pushed it so much that it actually engulfed the bearish candle. So it actually engulfed the bearish candle. So what exactly does this, uh, does this mean? That there are more buyers than the sellers. That is why even it is engulfing its previous day. So therefore, since there are more buyers than the sellers, then you can expect that the bulls are now in power and since bulls are in power therefore the market will now go in a bullish direction so that's you know uh, pretty much uh, it about the engulfing pattern this is bullish engulfing pattern similarly you can apply the same thing for um, bearish engulfing pattern okay now let's look at an example so let me move to the next slide okay now this is what a bearish engulfing pattern looks like so here what is what you will see is that there was a bullish pattern, uh, candle which was formed and the market as well was a itself was a bullish market. So a bullish market, a bullish uh, candle which was formed. But what you see on the next day is that there is a bearish candle which was formed. And, it, and there were so many sellers that even when it opened higher than its usual price, the sellers actually pushed the market below and it engulfed the bullish candle which was formed before. So therefore, you can see that from here onwards, there was a uh, there was a bearish market, and uh, you know the market actually went down. Now, of course, I won't use engulfing pattern on its own. I'll use I'll look at some other uh, values as well. I can look at RSI that whether it's an uh, overbought or oversold zone. Then I can see that whether it's happening somewhere near the resistance line. And that's when I'll, you know, confirm that, okay, this is a pattern which might give me a downtrend. Okay, um, now talking about stop loss, stop loss will be somewhere near the resistance line. And, um, uh, you know, I'll book profit somewhere near supports. So that's all for this video, guys. And I'll hope to see you guys in the next one.